Well, happening right now, city leaders are now working to mend their relationship with a 10-point coalition. That's that grassroots effort that aims to bring peace to neighborhoods that are crippled with crime in our community. Now, two people who work for the city are accused of making derogatory remarks about the coalition street patrols and also doing so on their media pages. Yeah, tonight at 5 o'clock, our own Crime Beat reporter Steve Jefferson has a close look at what was said and the punishment now for those two city employees. One of those 10-point coalition teams actually meet in this parking lot to do those street patrols, which is now being defended after coming under fire. And I was really stunned. 10-point coalition founder Reverend Charles Harrison defends the organization while teaching Bible class here at Barnes Methodist. He got word about social media posts from two city employees. Police liaison Greg Merriweather compared 10-point workers to prostitutes and community violence reduction director Shauna Majors posted dollar signs. Her boss, Indianapolis Mayor Joe Hotset, Charles Harrison is my friend calls their actions on social media unacceptable. I ask her to reach out to Charles Harrison, uh, to personally apologize to Reverend Harrison. Their actions resulted in majors receiving a formal warning from her supervisor and losing privileges to participate in the current grant cycle. Metro Police Chief Brian Roach suspended Merriweather three days without pay. The man who wants Hogsett's job... Yeah. Reverend Harrison and I are close friends. Called for a harsher punishment. If he doesn't fire them now, it's an endorsement of their divisive, ugly comments. Shauna has reached out to me. We had a, a great conversation um, this morning. If nothing else, Reverend Harrison hopes other people will join them to help make neighborhoods like this one safer. On the Crime Beat, I'm Steve Jefferson. Thank you, Steve. After accepting her apology for those social media remarks, Reverend Harrison has agreed to meet in the future with Shauna Majors.